vibrant, hot, and fun. That will be my three words. Hi guys, uh, my name is Jericho, Jericho van der Wolf. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm the chef of Lava. So Lava is about uh, dining, a proper dining experience, but also entertainment, music, uh, we have shows, and then obviously you can party at night. So we came up with a menu that is in uh, a few parties. And uh, the first part, very important part, is our Asian tapas. We have about 20 different Asian tapas that are all carefully uh, created and then um, and prepared with very fresh ingredients that you can enjoy as a sharing style. So very small bites or, or uh, tartar and fresh stuff to, to start your dinner. Then second part of the menu I will say is the kokoyaki. Kokoyaki is our uh, signature fire barbecue which is inspired by a Japanese technique uh, named wariyaki. And wariyaki you can find it in uh, a lot of izakaya restaurants uh, they usually cook their protein, so seafood or meat, uh, in a big hay fire. So instead of using hay, we wanted to give a, a real signature for lava concept. So we use a coconut husk, coconut fiber. And then we came up with this name, kokoyaki, which uh, koko in Japanese means coconut. So basically, Lava is a concept that uh, we did from the scratch uh, and come from the heart a lot. Uh, so we wanted to give like a hot food atmosphere uh, to our guests and also quality food and cocktail and drink selection. Uh, that's pretty much the idea of it uh, in a sense where we give warm, you know, from the name Lava. Uh, we give a lot of warminess to the people. So that's it. Lava actually became a cocktail destination in a few weeks. Uh, with like uh, people coming from like dinner or late party uh, to enjoy our eight signature cocktails. And uh, I have to say that it's pretty good to have like a nice selection of cocktail and getting people to try different flavor and going on different uh, kind of vibes. The idea is we have also like on the signature list, we have a coconut 2.0, for example, which is a twisted classic, twisted version, a bit futuristic of pina colada. But we also created our own, such as red lips, uh, that give an interesting name and interesting flavor. Uh, so we combine all the things with also following our concept to go like action, entertainment, on the table, making people feel wow when they receive a cocktail, such as dry ice, uh, you know, some action on the service where the bartender can interact as well. Um, this had been a great collaboration so far. Uh, we're very happy with uh, the rendering and how it went. Definitely on those cocktails, we go from like a Grandy Spritz in Atlas, from Atlas Bar in Singapore. We go from the unnamed cocktail that is uh, really interesting and as well the cocktail from Charles H in Seoul, uh, Bitter and Twice. Uh, but my favorite, honestly speaking, and the one that we're going to do for you today uh, is the Grandy Spritz. The Grandy Spritz idea is to go from the gin flavor to the freshness of the rosemary and going with like a slight bitterness from the pomelo, uh, which gives freshy and you can drink six to however number you want uh, without feeling bad. So it's good. Not only more cocktails, but you want to come back more as well. Our concept is from dining to party experience. So I would say that our customer, when they come, they're gonna feel they come for just a dinner and they're gonna end up with great memories. And that's pretty much the simple thing to describe lava. You come with expectation of a regular dinner and you end up with thousands of memories and you want to taste more. You're going to have a tuna tartar, spicy tuna tartar, that became uh, by itself a bit of signature now. We sell a lot and people really love it. So it's a tuna tartar with a puffed uh, wonton uh, sheet. So it's crispy, inside there is a tuna mousse. And then you have the spicy, uh, spiciness of the tuna tartar. So uh, when it blends all together, you have a certain balance that is created. 
uh, and then you're going to have also uh, our Asian sliders. Asian sliders, so instead of using a traditional burger bun, we do uh, a Chinese steamed bao bun. It's very soft, very moist, and then we put uh, fried chicken or we have fried beef as well with some uh, curry aioli and then some pickles and chili. So that will be for uh, the tapas. And uh, I'm going to give you our signature steak, which is the Café de Bangkok which this one is a reinterpretation, reinterpretation of the uh, Café de Paris uh, steak that you can find in, in various restaurants uh, over the world, which is normally uh, this green sauce that no one knows how to do, basically, with a grilled steak and served with fries. So we wanted to do it and, and really put our Asian flavors. So we took the basic of this sauce and then add up like uh, more Asian, Asian flavors into the sauce. And we have uh, this concept at Lava to also give a show. And we not only a dining, uh, just a restaurant, we, we try to attract customers with this wow effect on all dishes. So this one is flambé at the table. Then we bring it back in the kitchen and then we slice it and serve it at the table. We are surrounded by, uh, by Thai concept and Thai pub. So we mainly try to attract Thai customers. And then obviously we have a lot of uh, a younger uh, foreigners uh, crowd that's coming because they like the, the idea of uh, have a one-stop uh, one -stop address. Uh, you can come celebrate uh, with your friend and you don't specially have to go to a bar after because you have basically a full package. Uh, so we open late every day and then you can come for late dinner and then stay late obviously until closing. <laughs> 